Greetings comrades, Soviet Gaming here. Today we are doing Bountiful Trials, Arena of Trials for our new hero Hodgkin. So let's go and do it. <laughs> the rewards are as always the same, I already claimed one chest randomly. And let's go and fight those guys and get the best teams to deal with them. We'll start with this fight and go uh, clockwise as always. For this one I think I will use the Zyra because I like her a lot. We'll leave that guy Numisu in the back. Uh, another one will be Nara because Nara is good for pulling enemies and destroying them. And in front, I would say let's put uh, Rosalyn here. That might be a good option. Let's give it a try and see how it will go. We can't really order Rosalyn to follow someone specifically, so she will follow whoever she wants. Let's see how the fight will go. Uh, honestly, right now it's going pretty much okay. We don't really take uh, any serious damage and the enemies are taking... Oh, Nubisu got killed. But other than that, the enemies don't stand a chance. Yeah, we have only Brutus left and Screath and Screath is... Yeah, they're all dead. I think this Arena of Trials will be really easy because Hodkin is actually a really, really good hero. So, it's not really an issue for him to fight someone to protect your guys. Enemies... Uh, we will use the same team right now. Why the hell not? Usually it works. So yeah, I don't think it will be problematic for you because the guys are really, really good. Numisu is dead again, but after Kotkin release his uh, ship, the thing go haywire for the enemies and they they just been decimated as you can see here. Yeah. Oh, oh, Kotkin is almost dead, but he managed to survive. Uh, that Kaz is actually doing quite a lot of damage there. I'm surprised. Usually she's pretty much useless, like an off tank. But here it seems to work. Damn, I love his terrify ability. It's so good. Okay, so the enemies are almost destroyed. We have Kaz left and we have Ro uh, Rowan there. And he's dead as well. So that team works pretty well as well. We lost Numi, so might be better team. But overall, I wouldn't say that this is hard. And, you know, since we have time, we can use those guys. Uh, now we move on to this fight on the left. Over here we have Graveborn enemy team. I would like to make a Graveborn team as well. I think we tried it at the hero testing already and it worked perfectly well. So we will do just that. The only thing I want to change is the placement of this guy so he will be pulled by Nara. And I want to move Hawking down here. So now we're ready. Let's go. Uh, Cyrus being pulled by Nara but he really doesn't take that much damage from the enemy. Torn got destroyed. Hodkin with his ultimate, there we go, now stuff will go totally different way. Because the enemies... Oh, that was interesting. Nara tried to do uh, a finished move, but she failed. There we go, Cyrus in action. And yeah, they don't, don't really stand the chance, because Hodkin will have off heal. We have Nimora here for the healing, and the enemies are just being decimated here. The flag, when the flag is out... I mean, with the debuff from the Soul Siphon and the flag, the enemies are way, way weaker. And now guys have additional defense. There we go, we won. We lost two heroes, though, but it was an easy fight, I would say. Let's get the chest and move on to the next one. At the top, here we will face Tilin. Uh, but we have the same team. So I decided to switch things around a little bit for this one, so that's how we will go. Uh, let's start the fight and see if the enemies will be able to handle our anger. Honestly, I think that Isabella with the uh, Hodkin will be a good combo as well. Too bad, too bad that we don't have our own healer here. Mm. Yeah, so far so good. We lost Nemora though, somehow. The ship incoming. Yeah, ship was landed on the poor Butcher. That's the only enemy left other than... Tolin. Oh, that's a wrong area for the flag. But up, other than that, it was really good. Let's check the damage. Yeah, Isabella did a fantastic job. Alright, take the chest. And the last fight. Ah, not the last one. One before the last. I actually won this randomly before, but I'll do it again for you guys. So, Graveborn team. Basically, Odin. Uh, this guy. This lady. And let's put someone in front. I don't know. Laika will do. Let's put. Let's do it like that. Laika will help us to gain energy faster. So I'm curious. I, I, I've used a different team in in the testing, but 
This one works just as well, just as good. And look at that. They don't really stand a chance. That was instant decimation right here. Oh, God. That is OP, guys. That is OP. Let's check the stats. Oh, my God. The damage output is crazy. So, get this chest and now the last fight. So, guys, I tried several teams and this one seems to work the best. So, we have these guys. Uh, well, you know the, the team. You know how they work. So, let's just see how they work. What happens? Last time when I tried this, I tried it a few times. We have, like, two or three heroes still alive. And the fact that Kel'Thor dies the first is actually good because he does most damage like that. And the same result, we have two heroes still alive, now we gotta finish off the Thorin and uh, Lorsen and Tidus are doing a good job at that and there we go, we won. I haven't found a better team that kinda destroys everyone, so if you have the better team for this, let me know in the comments as well. And congratulations, the Arena of Trials is 100% completed and you got all the rewards. Nice! Let me know what do you think about this event in the comments. If you had issues with the last fight like I did uh, while going there, don't forget to like the video, share it with your friends and guildies, join the Discord, check the other playlists where we have more AFK Arena videos, and uh, that's about it. See you in the next one. Thank you for watching. Soviet out. До свидания.